They remove. They remove the uh, tennis. Well, they remove. Yeah, right. And, and then the you have line. to remember the eyeliner. <laughs> me and Dom would like be trying to look. Like they'd be like, "Yo, you got to all like air rays just flying over." So me and Dom gotta try to match our eyes. First of all, guys, I love this Transformers movie. It is my favorite in the franchise. Yes. And the music in this fire. Yes. It's the best music in Transformers movies. Um, this movie has very heavy CG. Anthony, can you talk to me about the challenges of acting without uh, with your characters that are supposed to be there but aren't in this film? Yeah, I mean, it, it was, you know, it was fun, man. It was fun. You're just making it up, you know, and, and thinking about, you know, what it could be. You know, like that, that's that's the best part. You know, when you're doing the scene and they're like, all right, they give you the eye line and that's all you get. They're like, yo, his head is here and this character's there, that one's there. They You do like two rehearsals with a, with some tennis balls and then that's it. They take them out and they're like, all right, cool, go with God kind of thing, you know? And and it's, <laughs> it's, it's fun though, man, it's fun because you're just like making everything up. And um, you know, you, you get to be a kid. It's were like, there any challenges about that? Were there any challenges? Yeah, I mean, they were challenged. Like, I guess, yeah, because right, it's it's a lot. When we when when we have scenes together, it's a lot easier for us to vibe. Yeah. But remember yeah. the well, they remove they remove the uh, tennis. Well, they remove. Yeah, right. And, and then the you have line. to remember the eyeliner. <laughs> me and Dom would like be trying to look like they'd be like, "Yo, you got to all like air rays just flying over." So me and Dom got to try to match our eyes. You know, and it's hard because I can't look at her and look, you know, so, yeah. so yeah, you know, so it's just trying to get in sync with that and be together. But it was, it was cool, man. It's it fun. fun. Now, Dominique, can you talk to me about bringing the humanity and heroism to the regular people in this world? Yeah, I think just starting with um, working with Steven on this, when he asked, when they told me that they were considering me for the role, I, I told Steven that, you know, I'm the type of actor I like to like give notes and I like to talk about character. Um, and he said, oh, you can give me your notes at two o'clock in the morning. <laughs> I didn't give them until at two o'clock in the morning, but I did make notes. And then I got to sit with the writers about two or three times just to talk about Elena and talk about character arc to make sure that she was, uh, that she had her own autonomy, that she had her own kind of story and we knew what she cared about. I think a lot of times with, with films, we know what the the main person cares about, but we don't know what the other people around them really care about. And I thought that that was really important, no matter what, for us to know what was driving her, what's her motivation motivation and her emotional. You added a lot with this. your dad, the monologue about your yeah. pops, you added the, the singing, right? Yeah. No, yeah, I think I was, I think it was already in, I think it was already in there, but it was like fleshing, like fleshing things out to make them even more specific. My character's from East New York, Brooklyn. I'm from East New York, Brooklyn. We got to do that on set together. Shout out our respective like yeah, hoods where shout we come out from. Bushwick. So it was that's fire. Like gonna be able to see it with my family yesterday. Anthony's gonna see it with his tonight. But I saw it with my family yesterday and their kids, and it was just exciting for them. When when I say East New York, everybody, ah, because we don't really you hear you hear about Bed Stuy, you hear Coney Island, Canarsie, but you don't really hear about East New York. And I promised. I promised Brooklyn that when I got the opportunity, I put East New York on the map. So that's what I'm going to do. And you did. Hey, Fantastic thank you. job. Look, this film is phenomenal. What a ride. I can't wait for people to see it on June 9th. And I'm going to go see it again for sure. Thank, thank you. Thank you guys so much for your time. I appreciate it.